Today in our 2016 Dodge Journey, we're doing a test fit of the Kuat NV 2.0 platform style two bike rack. That part number is NV22G. Now we already have our bike secured down. We're first going to show you one of the main features of this rack. We're going to come here in between our two cradles and we're going to pull down on this lever. With that pulled down, we're going to tilt our bike rack with our bikes fully loaded away from our vehicle and we'll gain full access into our back hatch area. This is going to allow us to get anything in or out that we may need. And what's great about this is that we don't have to worry about taking our whole bike, bike rack or our bikes off of our vehicle just to gain that access. Now how the bike itself is attached, we do have a cam buckle strap here at the back. We would just push on the gray portion and pull that through to release it. Then at the front we have a wheel hook which sits either in front of our brakes or in front of our frame depending on how our bike is made. We'll just push on the button to release that and then pull straight down to ratchet it down. You'll notice on the end of each cradle we do have a cable lock that's going to help to prevent theft and tampering of your bikes while they're loaded up on your bike rack. We'll put this back to the other side and we'll take a few measurements. First is going to be overall what we're adding to our vehicle. It's going to be about 31 and a half inches. Ground clearance is going to be about 21 and a half inches. Closest point is about 8 inches and from the center of our hitch pin hole to our closest point we're going to have about 11 and a half inches. Now we do have another position we can put this into. Again pulling down on that lever we can fold this up against our vehicle which will be perfect for close quarter situations. We can also open up this lever here and pull this piece out, which will allow us to make any adjustments that we need to to our bikes before or after a ride. So we're not going to have to worry about our closest point in this position, but overall now we're only adding about 16 inches to our vehicle with a ground clearance of about 11 and a half inches. Now how our bike is secured down, we have a pin and lock down here and that's going to help to prevent theft and tampering of your bike. And then here at the back we have our anti-rattle device which tightens everything up. It's going to keep a lot of shake and play out of that bike rack as you head down the road. So that's going to be our completed look at the Kuat MV 2.0 platform style 2 bike rack, part number MV22G on our 2016 Dodge Journey. First we'll take it onto our slalom course. This will show you the side to side action such as making turns or evasive maneuvers. Now we're at the alternating speed bumps. This will show you how it looks driving on uneven pavement or potholes. Finally, we're at the solid speed bumps, which simulates going into your driveway or parking lots. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.